Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do this quick indented scar. If you want to see how it's done, then keep watching. Okay, so you're going to start out with a flesh tone lip liner. I'm starting with Spice from MAC. And you're just going to draw out where you want that scar. So let's see. Alright, and then I'm going to get a blending brush and just blend it out a little bit, that harsh line. You can use any blending brush. I'm using a Cinema Secrets Blender Large. Then you're going to take your Rigid Collodion. I got this at Cinema Secrets in Toluca Lake. Um, you can pretty much get it at any makeup shop or online or eBay, Amazon. So I'm just going to open this up. And it's a little bottle like this. I'm just gonna take that little bottle and it's like a nail polish brush. We're gonna layer this on top of that scar. So I'm just gonna run it across here, right across that scar. Let that dry. We're gonna do different layers, so. Third layer. And this stuff is a little strong, so you want to try to avoid the eye area. So each time you let it dry, it's shrinking your skin and pulling that skin in and denting it and making it look realistic. So cool. I don't know if the camera's showing it very good, but... Especially thick right there in the middle. And then you're gonna wanna taper it thin off on the ends. You really want that part to be indented. Let's go in with another layer. I don't know if you can see that on camera, but it looks so realistic. Alright. I think I'm going to go with one more layer, just to really get that impact. Especially in the deepest area that I want it. Just fanning it so it gets a little bit drier faster and it's going to shrink up. So, yeah. Nice look there. And then what I do after this dries is to take away that shininess, I'm going to powder it a little bit. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> and I'm gonna throw in some concealer, just in certain little spots. Kind of on the edges. And taking that same lip liner pencil, the spice, I'm just gonna feather out the edges a bit. Thanks so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe if you haven't already. Bye!